Good morning, chill ladies. My name is Jacksepts again. Welcome to a game called Jalopy, which, as I understand it, a jalopy is a car, isn't it? I think so. Or maybe it's it's jalopy, or j jalopy, or yellopy. Maybe it's actually Finnish or something. <laughs> so this is a game where you have to build your own car. Well, not build your own car. But you have to put together the engine in it, and then you go on a little road trip, and you try and see how far you get. I think. I don't know. I don't actually know a whole lot about the game. I just remember it came out a little while ago, and I saw some other people had played it in my sub box, and I thought it might be a fun thing to actually do. We might be able to dick around it and have a little thing. A journey to the east. Hell yeah, I'll start a new game. Thank you for purchasing Jalopy during early access. This game is currently pre-alpha. This means the core gameplay experience is still changing significantly week to week. I hope you have fun, and please keep in mind, this is a work in progress. Feel free to report any bugs you find over on the Steam forums, pal. Uh, no, don't skip tutorial. Jesus Christ, no. I'm bad enough at games even when I do read the tutorials. I need this. Ah, fucking Jesus. It's too early for this shit. Wake up! Okay, God, fine, I'm awake. Ah, awake, finally. No, stay in bed any longer, and the day will make fools of us both. What fucking- Oh my god, your shirt! I don't know if I'm looking at you, or through you, or you have some sort of, like, time portal on you. That is messing with my head! Your shirt- your jacket is one giant optical illusion. Come now! I've got something important to show you. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's not your dick, is it? Is it 7.30 in the morning? Oh my god, there's a 7.30 a.m.? Fuck you, uncle, granddad, father, whoever you are, I'm going back to bed. Nude for personal. Hello, excuse me. There's dick with all the lights. Okay, what are you telling me? Oh my god, papa, you got me new car. It don't not got no wheels, though! <laughs> this is Leica! Leica Boss! Is a Leica 601 Deluxe. Looks like a piece of shit. <laughs> Something of an engineering legend in the GDR. That's for, that stands for goddamn racing. Zero to 60 kilometers an hour in 22.5 seconds. That's not that good. <laughs> A top speed of 100 kilometers an hour, all at an economical rate of 9 kilometers a liter. That is, if you can get her running. Oh, I'll get her running. I don't know if you know this, but I, my fingers are adept at putting cars together. Oh, we actually ha are at the Leica factory. Not to worry, I've everything ready. We'll just need to build her an engine, slap on some wheels, fit the passenger side door, and give her a bit of a clean. We'll also have to fix the- or fix all the shit inside of it, probably give it a little vacuuming, probably rewire all the circuits, put new doors on it, spruce up the interior, clean the windows, replace the windscreen, but after that, good as new. <laughs> so let's get started. Fit the replacement door, it's over on top of that scrap pile behind you. What? If you squint, you'll be able to see it. That one? That's not behind me. Whatever you say, space-time continuum dad. I'm way too hungover to do this. I got the door. Here I come. Look out. Here comes fun. Should I put it on? You look like an older version of me. I like you, pet pet. Boom. it's <laughs> on. That's what I like to say about everything I wear. Just put something on. My head's coming through a fucking sleeve hole. It's like, ah. Less than elegant, but it's on. I won't get eggs thrown at me when I go out the door. Right, now let's fit the engine. Oh, shit balls. Is <laughs> <laughs> Sylvester Stallone my dad? <laughs> if you open the driver's side door, you'll see a black latch. Pull that and it will release the button. The bonnet. Ah, oh, you actually call it a bonnet. That's what we call it over here. A bonnet and a boot. Not a trunk and a... Hood, I guess. If you open the driver's side door, you'll see a black latch. Okay. Huh. Let me in. Driver's side door, black latch. There we go. There you go. Thanks, Sly. Okay, now open the bonnet and I can walk you through this. Oh. Oh god, it's literally got nothing in it. Oh man, June 1990. Dude! 
I was only four months old at this point. Stay alert. Yes, stock engine. A small two-stroke engine with two cylinders. Comes as standard to all Leica 601 Deluxe cars. I got a big piece of equipment. Should I really be carrying the fucking engine block like this? Don't you usually need like a, a winch and some sort of pulley system? Oh shit. Poorly kept engine block will mean your Leica will struggle to perform. I missed the previous one because I thought he was just saying the same shit again. Go ahead, drop it into the engine. Boom. Nice. Beep beep to you too. That's the battery, which provides the electrical charge for your Leica. The battery allows you to use lights, the radio, the car, and listen. That kind of thing. I don't know if you're talking or if your stomach's just rumbling. If your Leica won't start, the first place to check is the battery. Go ahead, drop it into the engine. Boom. Nice. You're holding an air filter, a non-essential component. The air filter isn't necessarily required to run your Leica, but it's a good idea to have one as it will reduce the rate of wear to your engine block. Also, if you take off the air filter, your car sounds awesome. It goes from like... I mean, some people it sounds like shit, but if you're a 16 year old who loves a Honda Civic, that's your man. Fucking nice, Sue. That big lump of metal is the fuel tank, which holds the fuel of your Leica. A few notes in this one. First of all, it's gravity fed, so you'll need to open the bonnet and fill directly to the tank when refueling. Really? What kind of piece of dirt are you giving me? Well, it is 1990 in the game. It's not like he's giving me a Tesla or anything. Also, your Leica is running on a two-stroke engine. This means you'll want to mix in some oil to the fuel mixture. Uh-huh. Failure to mix oil into the fuel will mean the engine won't be lubricated and will wear at an increased rate. Too much oil, though, and you'll start to see performance drop. Keep your fuel tank well maintained, let it get too beaten up, and it will start leaking fuel everywhere. That's not what you want. Leaky fuel? That will cause this thing to explode. Okay, it needs fuel though. Yeah, I'm seeing a little container do. Dude, where's my wheels? That's what happens when you leave your car outside Dresden. Somebody steals all your wheels. I got a carburetor! I actually never knew what this thing does, so I want to learn. That's a carburetor, which controls the fuel consumption of the car, which in turn controls how many kilometers per liter you'll get out of your Leica. Oh! I always heard people in movies be like, have you checked the carburetor? And I'm like, yeah, car terms. I've also checked the squandner. That's running like it should. Double squans. A good, well-maintained carburetor will mean you use less fuel and can drive further for cheaper. Go ahead and drop it on in there, sonny. Cool! Engines coming together! We almost have a full block going on! This is awesome. This is just the beginning, by the way. I have to maintain this car as I go out of the road, or else my uncle's gonna beat me again. He just, like, he just shakes his jacket in front of me and I start getting dizzy. And then he just beats me over the head. Stock water tank. This just looks like a beaker. <laughs> It just looks like it's made of glass. That's the water tank which provides water to help keep your windscreen clean from dirt. Keep it in good condition to start leak water and you'll soon find yourself driving without any vision. This is that- this is not really that important. Okay, that's everything installed. Good job. Now to fill her up! We're getting nowhere without fuel. There should be a can of fuel, a bottle of water, and a bottle of two-stroke oil. We still need to fill the car with petrol, oil, and water. Why, Jess, she's a petrol car, no diesel this way. Go and collect them, and I'll walk you through f refueling your car. Okay. Will do! Pop, pop! Oh god. Oh god. Easy. Easy does it. I'm gonna drop all these things. I have a- I have a- a big thing of fuel, but I also have a bottle of sunflower oil in case I wanna fry some chips. That's a can of fuel you're holding there. We use that in the fuel gap. Okay, can I just pour it in? There we go. Nice! Try holding it there to fill it quicker. Oh. oh I'm putting carrot juice in! That'll really get my car going. Go ahead and drop that if you're done with it. How, how do I- how do I- how do I drop? I don't know how I drop things. Excellent! Let's move on to tires! Yes! Please! Let's go about getting some tires on the car. As you can see, we won't get very far without any wheels. You got that right, Jiminy Bob. There's a car jack over in the garage. Hey! I'm a car jack now. Putting together a car, we just became a car jack. Bring it over and we can get started. Will do. Oh god, trippy. 
Who told you that this was a good idea to wear? Whoa, look at all those sexy wheels. Nice. Okay, we gotta, we gotta prop this bad boy up. Okay, place the care jack under the car. Got it. Nice. One wheel. Boom. And two wheel. Sweet. Am I doing you proud, daddy? Okay, that didn't actually work. Let me just drop that and put that on. What, how, how do I, how do I use you? I'm doing it, please don't beat me. Can, can I have pizza for dinner? Good, now you can drop the car jack down, we can do it the same again. Okay, but seriously, pizza for dinner, right? I'm doing you proud, yeah? Dad? Uncle? Wherever you are? Space time continuum? Okay, I'm gonna put some stuff in the back. Um, have some, I have some oil, but I don't, I, I don't think it's going to help because I have no fuel left. That's fine. Anything else in here that I can use? I have no spare wheels or anything. Dag nabbit. Okay, are these tools? And a bucket of water. These things will do me, right? This is all I need. Tools. Bucket of water. Can I steal anything else? Pop, pop. I'll be there in two seconds. I just want to go and see if I can steal anything else off these cars. There's a lot of good materials around here. See, washing machine door can be turned into car wheel. But you didn't think about that. No, now I'm the genius. Okay, maybe I'll take the can anyway because who knows? I might get to a uh, truck stop and then I'll have to fill it up as well as the car. Down she goes. Let's pull this down. Can't be driving out. <laughs> we can't be driving out with the bonnet in our face. Okay, in we hop. Uh, before we set off, let's get you familiar with some important companions. Companions. Here we have the maintenance manual. We'll cover the basics of running the car. Okay. Oh. Okay. This one is important as it allows you to select which route you'll be taking between each destination. So we're going from Berlin to Dresden. 420 kilometers. Mother of God. Oh, here we fucking go. Keys, baby. In the ignition we go. Wait. Are you not coming? Is he not coming with me? Pop, pop, no! Maybe he's just taking a piss. Pop, pop. Okay. Why forever then? I'm just going to exor exorcism head. Do, 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 do. Right, let's start the ignition. Oh, she purrs like a brand new baby boy. Um, is that is that all I need to do? A uh, handbrake. And go. Oh, I'm going! Pop up! I'll do you proud! I'll get to Dresden! Don't you fucking worry about it, Pop Pop! Okay, out on the road at last! This is nice! Wait, do you drive on the right hand side of the road in this area? Because I drive on the left. Oh god, why does this car turn that direction on its own? Okay, off we go! It's a nice little car, my nice little jalopy. Out in the rain, all on my own. Do I have a horn? Beep beep! Look out world, here comes Jackaboy! To Dresden we go! This is cute! I like this! I like being out on the road on my own. Why am I just turning on its own? Oh god, this is hard to control. Ah, oh, so immersive. I'd like to thank my pop pop for teaching me how to run the car. Hopefully it stays together and I don't destroy it. You'll just see a newspaper clipping in the morning. It's like, young man dead on roadside after crashing car. Turns out he had no idea what he was doing. <laughs> Tried to fix engine, car exploded. Is it a tank? So this is, this is like going through Eastern Europe. Back at like an older time, I think. I can't, rem I can't remember the, the, oh God. I can't remember the, the whole synopsis. Of the game. We'll see how far I get. I, I plan on getting very far. Can I get out and actually like look at memorials? And shit. What does that say? Befreit uns noch mal. Short. Short. Yep. Appreciate it. Moving on down. I don't know which way is Dresden. Roundabouts are hard. I'm in the wrong lane for the first exit. Whatever. It's fine. 
I haven't crashed yet, and that's a good sign. I plan on not crashing. Ever. What does stuff in my car do? There's some lights. I don't need lights, though. I'll, I'll just drain my battery if I turn on lights. There's shit all over the road! Oh, hey! That's another person that was just out driving for the day. Aw, I wanted to say hi to them. We could have been driving companion buddies. Am I driving a bit too fast? What's the speed limit? I don't know, but I've gone 76 kilometers so far. That's not too fucking bad. I need my map. Oh god, what's that? Potholes! Oh shit! Ah, hello, can we get the fucking council to fix this? Potholes on my road. My car can barely even drive in a straight line. How's it gonna manage potholes? Oh, 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 hi! Hi, sorry, am I driving too slow? I mean, I have to. Go around! There you go. Oh, their car is much better than mine. I'm much faster. These people are making fun of me. Oh, you think you're better than me, don't you? And your little Toyota Corolla. Fuck! Okay, uh, barriers. Okay, they're there to save us. Or to save you from me, I think. Because I am a bad driver. I, I, there's no, like, learner plates or anything on this. Okay, we might have to pull over soon. I'm coming, I'm coming down to half fuel. But I think I've gotten a, a good few kilometers. I don't know if there's actual fucking potholes everywhere. I don't know if there's actual, like, real distance in this. If I'm going to be driving for 420 kilometers, you know, kind of like a, a truck sim kind of thing. I, th I think we're good. This isn't Euro truck sim. We'll be fine. I'm just delivering a, a bunch of, a basket of puppies to Dresden. Oh, that's not good signs. The nearest this storm would alleviate. There's fucking oil spills and everything. I swear nobody checks these roads. And my uncle doesn't care very much for me if he just let me out and go. He just he just gave me a car and said, hey, Sonny, get going. Oh, I hit a fucking oil patch. I couldn't turn there for a second. Anyone behind me? No. I also like the last guy who came up behind me. The horn was just, Arooga! <laughs> A very classic, old-timey cartoon horn. I like it. Those are some nice factories in the distance, though. I can't take out my map, though, for some reason. Oh, careful. <laughs> okay, let's pull over for a second. Besides, beside this Amazon box. Let me just check shit. How do I take out my map? Is there an actual button for the map? Okay, open that. I can't just click on the book. Why? <sighs> Let's just sit here. Relax, take it out. I've been driving. I've been driving for a while. It's like, it's like what? What time is that? Is it six? I'm driving all day, man. I deserve a rest. It's been raining the entire time as well. That's not, it's not an easy road to go down. Oh, shit. Lights are coming on. Time flies by in this game. Okay. Probably should be careful. I don't want to get hit by lightning. Cause this thing is a fucking rust bucket. Hello, excuse me. Okay, bye. Fuck you then. Ah, oh, this is nice. Wait, is there any actually anything in these? Hello. There's a lock on them. <gasps> I'm gonna steal this. I found this. I found this. This mine now. I can't put in. I put in anyway. Fuck. Wait a second, I have an idea. Shh, no one's gonna, no one's gonna know a thing. I'm just gonna put it here, and I hope that that person drives over it. Either that or we cause a traffic collision, and that'll be hilarious all in itself. Come on, come on, Betsy. They fucking drove past it. Okay, okay, round two, bitches. <laughs> yes, yes! <laughs> Fucking thank you! You didn't open it or anything, but that was awesome! Okay, let's uh let's try this again. No, wrong lane, bitch! Aww. I don't know why I'm calling everyone bitch. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sure you're wonderful people. It's, just, it's been a long day. And I'm out on the road and I don't want to get back to driving just yet, because I'll have to use my i have to use my battery to turn on my lights and all that kind of shit. So I don't really want to do that. I just want to cause accidents. Where's the next car? Come on now. Really? No one, no one's going to show up again. 
Is it because you all know that I'm out on the road now and everyone got scared and went inside? Probably. Okay, let's close this. Let's get back in the car, it's cold. I want to get back in and be all cozy and warm. Oh yeah, listen to that. Ooh, it makes me feel toasty. Let's turn on our blinkers. Tick, tick, tick. Our little, our little emergency lights. Our little indicators. Are we good? What time is it? God, it's almost midnight. I feel like I've got enough sleep though, right? I feel like that that weren't- do I actually have to sleep? Is fatigue a thing that happens in this game? Who fucking cares? Okay, you started. Jesus, I didn't think you were going to there for a second. Okay. And away we go! See you later, fuckers! I'm on the road! So, mothers, lock up your daughters! Here comes Jack! Not because you, I, I'm going to steal them or anything, but because I'm a terrible driver and I'll probably kill them. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the road again. It's lonely out here, man. I have a fucking radio that I can turn on. Oh, Jesus, fuck! Oh, God, let that be a lesson to you. If you shut up, how oh, God. If you don't look at where you're going, if you don't pay attention to the road, if you take your eyes off the road for a split second while you're sleep deprived, you're gonna die! You're gonna be in a traffic accident! Oh, so this sounds like Toto's Africa. Slow down! Might have fucked my car in this one. I can't go above 25 miles an hour. I can't I can't get to 30. Oh, this does not look good. Why do I have to turn on some sick tunes? Here's me just thinking that there'd be some fucking Bruce Springsteen or something on, but no. I almost upturned my ass. Is there any sort of like fucking rest stop or anything along this way? I'm kind of hurting here. Here we go, Ash, we're grand. It was only because I was trying to get up the hill. I know how you feel, Jalopy. It's an uphill battle, day to day. But you can make it, I believe in you. Just don't crash and kill me, please. Make sure- Fuck! <laughs> I have to look back to see if there's anyone behind me. The fucking rear view mirror doesn't work. It should, but it fucking doesn't. Okay, you know what? Let's stop for a sec. Shut the fuck up. I don't care anymore. You're distracting me. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, I think I just got a flat tire. Oh, no! Dresden is so close, though! We can make it! I believe in us! I believe in our little jalopy! I don't have a fucking spare wheel! What am I supposed to do? Oh no, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Do you think that that has a spare wheel on it? Let me just see for a second. I'm gonna leave the car running for two seconds. Uh, handbrake. Get out. Nobody crashed into my car. Do you have anything on you that I can use? You're just a piece of shit! Wait, let's open up the, the, the bonnet. It's fucking stuck! Ah, jeez, spice. I got black paint. Cool, can I paint my door? Can I paint my whole car? Nice! Fucking looking swanky! Who needs a limo to the dance now? Yes! Blacking out all my windows, so nobody can see me in the back of the car. This the shit right here. Okay, I'm done with that. Right. That was totally fucking worth it. Black beauty! On we go! See you later! I can't like the sound of that flat tire now. What just happened? Did I just fuck up my handbrake? What? What's going on? Motherfucker! Why is there no spare tire in this car already? What is this horse shit? Do I have to fix you all on my own? Oh, but why though? Okay, here we go. Take off the wheel. Here we go. Can I put you in the can I put you in the back somewhere? I really should have had a spare. Anyone want to lend a hand? I mean, I don't really have a choice. I think my car is fucked anyway. I can't 
My handbrake broke. My car's just stuck here. Well, now we wait. Jesus fucking Christ! Oh my God! Hit and run, police! You gotta fucking help me! Yeah, at least my windows will be clean, right? This sucks. If I do this, will people stop? Probably not. How far did we get? Can I even check that? Drive home. Could I, could I just drive home? Drive home. Hey, return home. Are you sure you want to return home? This will allow you to take everything you've gathered from your trip home without incurring shipping costs. Yes. <gasps> I made it! Uncle! I'm back! I fucked up your car! Well, I guess it's my car. Oh, look how sexy it is. I should have kept the black paint. Now the good door looks like the shit door. Kind of broke all the windows, though. You can... Aw. Oh. I can smell the disappointment off you. Look deep into my eyes, father. Tell me. Am I a failure? Am I? <laughs> okay! Well, that's it for this episode on Jalopy. Actually quite enjoyable. I very much enjoyed that. I probably should fix up my car and make another attempt. I can't remember which wheel was fucked. Oh, it was this one. And then... Does it tell me? Durability zero of three. I think everything's just fixed. Durability two of three. Did I just fix my wheels? Oh, wait, no. Zero of three means it's broken. Ah, oh, I get it. So I can fix everything up and try again? Oh man, I don't know if I want to do that. Ooh, little Amazon shipping boxes. So there's not a whole lot to it, but it is somewhat immersive to just sit in the car and go along and see how far you can get. I almost got there. I think there was actually a service shop that I could have turned off to and went to, but I was like, oh, I'm so close to Dresden, I'll just go there and see what happens. But nope. Let that be a lesson as well. Never overreach. Don't bite off more than you can chew, because the world will bite back. And then you'll be fucked and you'll have to drive home and your uncle, dad, will look at you and be like... And then you'll feel the sadness again. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it... What was that? Punch that like banana face! Like a car! And... I face around. Whoosh! Whoosh! Thank you guys so much. See all you dudes! What's the eye? Get it? Cause it's a like a car? Huh? Genius.